Jace the Bee, Journey to the Polka Dot Village. Written and illustrated by Calvin Reynolds. It was a warm, sunny day. Jace and Dex were full of laughter and cheer while enjoying the spring sunshine. The two friends raced flower to flower, seeing who could collect the most nectar. Dex noticed an odd look on Jace's face. Hey Jace, what's wrong? He asked. Well, spring is almost over, and we haven't seen our friend Lily. Jace replied. I'm sure she's busy with her chores and plans on visiting soon. Dex said. Suddenly, Jace had an idea. How about we pay her a surprise visit? Dex paused and responded with a big smile on his face. You know, that's an excellent idea. The next day, the two honeybees flew through the forest, eager to visit their ladybug friend. Lily lives in a hidden place deep within the forest called Polka Dot Village. Along the way, Jace and Dex spotted their friend. Sammy the Frog. Hey, you two, where are you going? Sammy asked. We're on our way to visit a friend, Jace replied. Sammy blushed and said, I'm having a hard time getting to the other side of this pond. Could you guys help me out? Always happy to help a friend in need, Jace answered. Dex swiftly flew over to a large petal on the ground. If we place this in the center of the pond, Sammy can jump to it and then to the other side. Dex explained. That's a great idea, Jace said. The two friends carried the pedal to the middle of the pond. Okay, Sammy, jump on the leaf and then you'll be able to leap to the other side. Dex explained. With two huge jumps, Sammy made it. Thanks, guys. Sammy croaked as he happily hopped away. As the two friends continued on their journey, Jace began to hear loud sounds of chatter. When he landed behind the grass, Jace was surprised to see a group of cheerful ladybugs joking and laughing. Look, there's Lily over there, Dex said with excitement. Jace leaped from behind the grass and shouted, Surprise! All the ladybugs scampered away in fear except for Lily. What are you guys doing here? Lily asked. We were worried. We haven't seen you in a while. Jace answered. Why did your friends run away as if they saw a ghost? Dex questioned. Lily began to explain. Ladybugs are not allowed to interact with bees. Jace and Dex stared in disbelief. Is that why you haven't returned to Beetopia? Jace asked. Yes. She whispered. The elders have forbidden me to visit. This news made Jace and Dex very sad. But, uh, but you're our friend, Lily. And all the bees of Beetopia adore you. Is there something we can do to change their minds? Jace cried. Before Lily could respond, the ladybugs returned with Lady Lauren and Lady Lila the leaders of the Polka Dot Village. Lily, are you all right? Have they harmed you? Shouted Lady Lila. No, I'm fine. Lily replied. Who are you and why are you here? Lady Lauren demanded. I'm Jace and this is my friend Dex. Jace answered with a smile. He nudged Dex to say something. Uh, hello. Dex murmured while avoiding eye contact. Jace explained that Lily was their friend and considered a hero in the colony of Beetopia. The elders were very disappointed. <gasps> Bees are dangerous and we have no business calling them friends. Elder Lila exclaimed. I know bees have a reputation for being mean, but it's not true. They are kind and gentle. Lily explained. There was no convincing the elders. You are not welcome here and must leave now, Lauren declared. Jace and Dex waved goodbye as they began to fly away. Suddenly, a large shadow flew overhead. Everyone stood frozen with fear. 
It was three large dragonflies, and they were flying right towards the ladybugs. Everyone get back to the village now, shouted Elder Lauren. The ladybugs scattered as the dragonflies began to attack. Dex, we have to help them. I'll distract the dragonflies while you help everyone get to safety. Jace exclaimed as he strapped on his magical brace. Okay. Dex responded. Dex splattered one of the dragonflies with his slingshot. Over here! Jace shouted. The remaining dragonflies began to chase after Jace. He was able to lead them away from the ladybugs. Meanwhile, Dex helped Lily and her friends return safely to the polka dot village. Is everyone okay? Dex asked. Lily responded. Everyone seems fine, but where's Jace? He lured the dragonflies into the forest. Dex answered. He could be in big trouble. We have to help him. Lily exclaimed. Lady Lauren nodded and said, You have our permission. Lily pulled out her wind dasher. But before she could say another word, Dex grabbed her hand and sped off into the forest. Meanwhile, Jace zoomed through the woods with the dragonflies in hot pursuit. He aimed his magical brace and sprayed an oncoming tree branch with tree shot, causing it to fall on top of the trailing dragonfly. One down, one to go. Jace cheered. The last dragonfly grabbed Jace in midair and threw him to the ground. When I finish with you, <laughs> chuckled the dragonfly, I'll go back and finish those tasty ladybugs. <laughs> Suddenly, Jace heard a loud splat. With one loud jerk, the dragonfly was slurped into the mouth of Sammy the Frog. Dragonflies are yummy to my tummy. Sammy gulped while licking his lips. Thank you, Jace said with a sigh of relief. You're welcome. When I saw dragonflies chasing you, I figured I could help. Sammy replied. Jace embraced Sammy with a big hug. When Lily and Dex arrived, they were happy to see that Jace was safe and sound. Earlier today, you guys were happy to help me cross the pond, so I'm glad I was able to repay the favor, Sammy explained. When you're kind to others, it comes back around. Dex added with a smile. The group said a final goodbye, and Sammy hopped away. The three friends flew back to the polka dot village and stood before the ladybug elders. We were wrong about you two, said Lady Lauren. Today, your bravery has made it crystal clear that you are indeed noble friends of the polka dot village. All the ladybugs cheered happily while greeting their new bee friend. After a long day of excitement, it was time for Jace and Dex to return home. As they began to fly away, Jace looked back and shouted, We'll see you soon, Lily. She smiled and waved goodbye until her friends vanished from her view. With one kind act, Jace and Dex created a new friendship between the bees of Beetopia and the ladybugs of the Polka Dot Village. The End Trust in yourself, you'll soon find The power that's within to fly and shine Keep your vision clear, your goals in sight Believe in your dreams with all your might Through ups and downs, through thick and thin Believe in the magic that lies within With the courage in your heart, you will believe Like Jace the Bee, you can achieve J-A-Y-C-E, Jace